China is aggressively unleashing lethal, fully autonomous drones that can carry out targeted military strikes, a think tank has warned. The killer drones and pilotless aircraft fitted with AK-47 rifles are being exported to Asia, Africa, and combat zones in the Middle East. U.S. National Security Think Tank Center for a New American Security, or CNAS, said in a report, that Chinese officials see this AI arms race as a threat to global peace. Gregory C. Allen, the author of the report, said China is rushing to integrate even more sophisticated artificial intelligence into weapons and military equipment. He pointed out that drones, both large and small, are a particular example of a type of weaponry that is increasingly becoming automated. Now, I'd like to point out that the U.S. already has fully automated drones in service and has had them in service for at least 10 years. But China is being more aggressive about introducing greater levels of autonomy closer to lethal use of force, he went on to say in his report. One example is the Blowfish A2 drone, which China exports internationally in which Mr. Allen says is advertised as being capable of full autonomy all the way up to targeted strikes. The Blowfish A2 autonomously performs complex combat missions, including fixed point timing detection and fixed range reconnaissance in targeted precision strikes. Now, depending on customer preferences, Chinese military drone manufacturer Zion offers to equip Blowfish A2 with either missiles or machine guns. Now, Mr. Allen went on to say that many current generation drones are primarily rem remotely operated. Chinese officials generally expect drones and military robots to feature even more extensive AI and autonomous capabilities in the future. China is getting more ag aggressive at stealing technologies and trying to come up with their own AI type drones. And they, in recent years, have doubled their efforts. What do you think? Will China eventually catch the United States in autonomous drone warfare? Leave your comments below this video. Thanks for watching.